glams it has been a while and i owe you an explanation i really do i kind of dropped off the face of the earth you know it is now what almost february 1st i think february is like in three days got my braids as always um there's just been a lot going on in my life and um i am just not there anymore you know what i'm saying it's like i'm not i'm trying to but i can't like be fully here there here and here it's like too much going on it's like it's a lot you know it's a lot so especially when i don't have like the support that i need it's a lot and i'm not talking about you guys or nothing like that i just mean like home base um we had a great christmas everybody was fucking on top of the world they got everything they needed i spoiled everybody don't ask me if i was spoiled but just know that i am a giver and i wanted to make sure that everybody else was um happy i even got him a ps5 i lucked up i was able to luck up and get this ps5 for him which was really crazy because you couldn't get one anywhere and i got a special invitation from playstation to buy one personally so <sighs> yeah talk about luck then my whole eye transformed on me guys i'm gonna put pictures up while i'm talking about this on christmas we all open up presents my tree what it looks like then we went to waffle house took the kids out for breakfast that morning um we had a snowstorm like immediately right after Christmas and our lights went out for like three days. So three and a half days. So we ended up going to a hotel, driving back and forth. We had to drive like two hours away just to find a hotel because everybody was freaking out where I live. So nothing was close by. And then we got another snowstorm four days after that one knocked out the power and we were terrified that this thing, you know, the same shit was going to happen. So boom you know it's just been like uh storms after storms over here and not only that but also relationship wise storm wise you know a lot of shit just dealing with a lot realizing a lot and um we just kept getting into arguments it's just like a whole lot with me and jamal you know what i'm saying it's just a whole lot communication wise and it's a whole lot that i'm just realizing that i just kind of you know yeah it's not the right time to talk about this but let me just say that you guys will hear more just probably not right now um i am in the process of you know i'm an amazon vine worker but one night i was fed up i was fed up just going through a lot and after hearing some of the most disturbing words coming from his mouth i jumped onto my phone and i looked for an overnight job i haven't worked y'all know the last time i worked was like when i lived in the other state before we moved here and then i was working in the house as well i was working uh babysitting jobs and selling shit and whatever else this amazon vine thing is amazing because i'm able to just pretty much work from home and do what i need to do but i was just very fed up and um within 15 minutes i got a um i saw a job available online i immediately clicked on it i got an email for the job saying you're immediately hired if you fill out this application and uh you do the drug test you have no worries as long as you pass i was like what the next day like damn i'm just filling this shit out did not expect anything so i ended up getting a job i went the next day and got a drug test um she passed with flying colors and shit so i made a cute little tiktok about it i may or may not include this in the video just so you guys can see i heard amazon was hiring and they stopped drug testing for this let's see if this really works because i may or may not have smoked before i got here me thinking I messed something up. The test is oral so I had to. Keep this in my mouth for 10 minutes. I left and had to wait on my results. The next day. 
OMG, not them actually hiring me. Um, yeah. So I start work very soon. I'm excited. It's going to be a change of pace. And especially with me homeschooling and stuff, and then these kids of mine, Lord, I may have to send them back to school because it's not even an option for me. I would love to keep them home, keep them safe, but they're not giving me that same can respect back you know what I'm saying um they're not doing their work they're not you know they're playing games and instead of doing their work and you know lying about shit when I walk away and you know and yes I'm there I'm hands-on I'm s sitting right there with them my daughter will she'll try to sit in a in a uh, certain position to where she can't be seen and then she'll click off of something or try to have two tabs up and you know just trying to be slick and shit so then you got my son up here, y'all. Uh, just disturbing shit. I just behavioral issues. I ain't even finna touch that right now though, cause I don't even want to go there. I just don't, y'all. Just pray for me, please, because um, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I slept wrong, so this part in my face is like still raised up a little bit. So that's what I was just looking at. But yeah, there's it's just been a lot. But, um, just a quick little update. I am still alive. If you guys don't follow me on TikTok, it's probably the number one place I post. IG would be next. And, um, I have a Facebook, but it's just, I don't, I don't like inviting new people on there. So, yeah, I have about a good 300 people in my friend, my friend box waiting to be approved. And I'm just like, mm -hmm. Nah, I'm okay. So, yeah. But TikTok and um, definitely IG. I'm always posting my cute little pictures and the stuff that I get. So, if you guys want to keep up, you're more than welcome to. I will try to keep up with this um, whole page over here somehow. But just know that I love you guys. And uh, I had an amazing experience where my mom came to me through text message. And... I know you guys won't understand what I'm really saying, but there's this person that I talk to and they're very spiritual, very spiritual. It taps in a lot. We were conversing and out of nowhere, they started scrambling their words and my mom reached out to me through this individual and um, it was incredible. It was incredible and it touched me so much and just the message that I got. So I know I'm on the right track. My mom has been trying to get in contact with me. I know you guys are probably like, what the fuck are you talking about? But yeah. Yeah. If I can blur them out, I will kind of put a screenshot over here. So that way you can kind of understand how the text went. But yeah. Keep your head up. Stay blessed. Yeah. I know that I am. I just need to be in a better situation. That's all it is. I love you guys. I'll see you soon, though.